Okay, this video is talking about the right hand and left hand behavior of the graph of the polynomials. Up to now, we only have talked about mostly linear function and quadratic function. So this time, we are talk about a higher degree polynomial such as a cubic function or four degree function or fifth degree function. So. Let me show a few examples of um, higher degree even polynomial graph and then we talk about what happened. Okay, so let's look at fx equal to maybe 2x to the fourth power plus 3x to the cubic minus uh, 5x plus maybe two like that so do you see what happened here so as you see we only think about the ending behavior so left hand side and the right hand side here i'm gonna make a little bit wider so you can see better so as you see it's going up on the left hand side or going up on the right hand side as well now let me make another one. So gx equal to maybe x to the sixth power and plus 5x cubic power and minus 7x plus 6 like that. Okay? What happened? So, so red function also, the left hand side going up again and right hand also, also going up again here. So let's make another one, maybe hx equal to 3x to the 8th power minus 4x to the 2nd power and plus 1 like that. Okay, so they're also going up and going up again here. So let me just turn on one graph each so we can see a little better so the last one hx as you see 3x8 minus 4x squared plus 1 the left hand going up and right hand going up now gx function also left hand going up and the right hand going up here now fx also left hand going up and right hand going up as well so based on this fact or our observation, we can conclude that if given fx equal to axm plus bxn plus something like that, if m is even power and then a is positive, then we can conjecture the left hand side and right hand side ending behavior will be going up and also going up as well. What about A is negative? To understand better, I just make every leading term is a negative sign. Other terms are not even matter, only leading terms matter. So I'm going to switch this to minus. What happened? Before, it was going up, going up. So, which means left hand side going up and the right hand side going up. Now, it is going down and going down here, right? So, look at this. I'm going to make a minus and enter. Then what happened? This also going down and going down here, right? Then hx also just make minus sign in front. Then what happened? Going down and going down here. So based on this fact, we can say that if a is negative, then the ending behavior will be going down and going down. 
of course as you see all this graph all this graph the middle term can be various it can be somehow maybe parabola shape but sometimes this kind of irregular shape or what kind of a fluctuate like that but no matter what when leading term is positive then both are going up and up and negative then going down and down then what about a is m is odd number so odd power here can you conjecture this function behavior of the left hand ending point and the right hand right hand ending point so look at some function here again so f x equal to so a x equal to maybe 2 x to the fifth power plus 4 x to the square and then plus like that then now the left hand side going down the right hand side going up here right so down and up another one so bx equal to maybe 4x to the seventh power plus 5x to the fifth power minus 6x square plus 3 something like that so before it was only fifth power now it is seventh power but still going down and going up right so based on this observation we can say that if m is odd but a is bigger than zero then left hand side going down and right hand side going up basically then what about a is negative power a is negative so to make easier just to make these two function negative sign of the leading leading term here so minus and then minus so what do you see before we are changing to negative it was left hand side down right side up now after change leading term is negative sign then become left hand side moving up the right hand side moving down same thing here p function if i just switch the positive power again then become left hand side down right hand side up but if I switch this minus sign, then this become left hand side going up, the right hand side moving down here. Therefore, we can conclude that if A is negative, then left hand side moving up, the right hand side moving down like this. Okay?